Welcome back to Risk Green 2. Yes, I'm on easy. I'm on uh, drizzle. Am I proud of it? No. Are we doing it anyway? Yes. Why? Because I don't want to think. Don't know why I'm being so aggressive with my questioning of myself. But we're getting there. What are we doing today? We're going OP. We're going just pure death. Just complete and utter death. The uh, most important thing in our build. The most important thing in our build. 57 leaf clover. It's so good. The second most important thing in our build. And we're going to start off the shipping request form. The second most important thing in our build, HEG missiles. That's it. That's that's what I want the build to be. HEG missiles and definitely covered. There's going to be some extras, obviously. Mocha, soldier syringes. Uh, I'm going to run for no reason other than pure overpoweredness. Um, predatory instincts and some crit chance. The thing is. I don't actually need to waste any whites on lens maker glasses. Because 57 leaf clover will re-roll my quit chance for every time I have a 57 leaf clover. And I'm not going to get 100% because that's not how the game works. Unless I use lens maker glasses to put myself over the 100% chance threshold. There's no point in that. I don't need it. The other thing is I'm going to be using some Renzod Agia, some Rejuvenation Rack. It's just... It makes my life so much easier. Um... Oh. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. Pocket ICBM. Yeah. That's a thing. It's still a thing. It continues to be a thing, and it probably will be a thing in a year. Because when the devs made it, they didn't think, oh, someone's going to take advantage of this, and the fact that HG missiles are already overpowered, and the fact that 57 leaf clover is already a thing. You know, put them together, what you get? I'll show you what you get. Let me run you through my method. I get on, I scan. If there's a mountain shrine, I go straight towards it. If not, I kill some stuff, buy out the chain shrines, and then go to boss. Now, we made some progress. 25 mockers, 25 tougher times. I also go and get this. We're about to have another red. Just here like that. We're on 357 leaf clovers. Um, I'm using the, if you're curious, my chance to proc an ATG missile is slightly lower than the crit chance. Uh, because my crit, base crit is 11% and the base crit for an ATG missile is 10. Um, just wrecks. Uh, let me show you. Here, we're on 34.4, that's saying 37.26. Um, I'm focusing greens on getting me reds rather than upping my damage. I have three of every other green that I'm going to use. I am using regenerating scrap because uh, I can buy reds with it at the shop. I'm also going to the shop every time. Oh my god. Um, I added ukuleles into the mix. And then I remembered that they can proc... Well, okay. I remembered ukuleles can proc ATG missiles, so I added them. Shooting a group of enemies. That one can I move? Dangerous for frames. Hi. You join me in the shop between oh, stage 17, 125 minutes into the run. Uh, and I'm going to buy some of these. 
I think we're very close to hitting. Yeah, I can buy a lot of these. Uh, do one more. Wow, it took a feather. That's fine. So, my crit chance is 1% higher base than my ATG missile. And we're at 99.25% crit chance. ATG missile's at 98.8. Look at this. Just missiles everywhere. Jesus Christ. 99.1. Ninety-nine point two. I feel like this is how slow it's going to be. We're going to get fifty of them. What are we at now? Ninety-nine point five. Ah, oh, fifty's nice. Fifty rerolls from fifty-seven leaf clover. Ninety-nine point five percent proc chance. 99.74 on the 11, so... Ooh. Hello there. Oh, damn. So, I may have got carried away at this point. Again, my missile build was done. I had the 99.5% proc chance. I could have just built HG missiles for damage. And then I thought, you know what would be funny? Stacking Brilliant Behemoth. So I did. And this is what happened. Oh my... There's just... I am, I am become death, the destroyer of worlds. That is a very scary noise. Alright, my feathers didn't work. That, or I'm incompetent, probably the latter. But, um... I saw a video... A while back. Somebody claimed that they were going to make more explosions than ever seen on Discovery. I think... I may take that mantle. Maybe not more. But bigger. And as we all know, bigger is better. Holy mother of God. What's wrong? Look at that. It covers the entire hexa hexagon. Oh, I can't speak. I'm too excited. I don't actually even need to aim it towards them. It just hits. But then when I do hit, everything procs. Oh my god. I can't see. My screen. Whoa, what was that? Shh. You think you can defeat me? You have no chance. Actually, try and aim at the map. Oh god, where, where are they? 
Holy mother. I'm surprised that also in 22 stages didn't get a single shiny gold. What are you gonna do? Right? Kill me? <laughs> he almost killed me. Ah! Um. Yeah, there's, there's this. Ah! Ah! No! Okay. Maybe giving them ATG missiles that apparently just go off randomly. Not the best idea. Uh... 48 million damage. I can't see my items. I think Risk of Rain should change that. Oh my god, that was uh, bright. Very orange, I think. Yeah, that happened. Anyway, if you enjoyed me going insane and seeing just explosions and blood everywhere, please leave a like, leave a comment subscribe please i'm desperate doesn't cost anything but it makes me feel good um and yeah if there's anything you want to see in this game or if there's any other games you want to see um i might already own or not uh let me know and i'll see what i could do i'm trying to branch out a bit more other than just risk of rain um there will be more teardown videos as well and i'll see you in the next one guys